Welcome back to the channel everyone. If you don't know, I'm Epic Assassin and this is the Epic Gaming channel. As always guys, you can find me on Twitch and Twitter. I'm going to be changing up my Twitch schedule a little bit. It's going to be Monday, Wednesday, Saturday from 6 to 9. Hopefully I can be a little bit more consistent with daily life. So let's get into the video. Some of you may have seen when Sam Woodhall redid Pokemane's full stream, added some dope transitions, added a new overlay and everything. Well, he did his in Apple Motion, and I'm going to show you how to do it in After Effects. So, as you can see, this is my um, transition. What we're going to be doing is creating these in After Effects. So we start off by having a 1920 by 1080, 60 frames per second. I usually put it at about 30 seconds because you don't want your transition to be more than like five seconds anyways. Create that composition. We start by making a normal white right center. Then we go to transform and we rotate it. Adjust the scale however you like. Even have it angled the other way. I just do it this way because that's the way I've done it. Then take this and put it in silhouette alpha. The key to this is to make sure it overlaps with your silhouette. You don't want any of that showing. Make sure you get out of that so it doesn't automatically connect it. And get another. Out of that. Add up to the top. That is your basic mask. Once we have our basic mask, Highlight all of these. You're to do it this way. And we pre compose it. I'm going to call this mask. Okay. That brings it into its own group. Where you can click inside of there, change things if you need to. Now, once we have our mask, Once we have the uh, screen that we want to stay mapped to the rest of the transition, all we have to do is bring in the picture that we want to transition with, change it to alpha inverted mat, and there you have it. The rest from here is setting up the keyframes. But as you can see from here, all you have to do Drag it across, and it'll reveal the image as it goes around. Now you're gonna have to scale it to where it'll actually fit inside before the transition starts. Then it comes on screen. You can have it pause, you can have it just go straight through, and then it ends on that full green screen. That way it can transition. Now that we got the hard part over with, the transitions is so easy to set up. All you have to do, come to the mask, transform, hit this little time button. That creates our first keyframe. Take it up a few seconds, or milliseconds. And we drag it over. Now say you want to pause it there, you just add that keyframe, come over a few seconds, make another keyframe, keep it going a little bit, and drag it the rest of the way, and hit play, see what you've created. Now all you gotta do is shorten it, that way it doesn't make 
play through the entire 30 seconds. There you have it. Some simple but very clean transitions. As always guys, thanks for watching the video. Like and subscribe. Let me know what you want to see next in the comments. And have a good one.